hey, we're in a little village in southern China, and this is miles on my head. This is one of the Hakka round buildings. So they're built mostly for defense, as you can guess. It's pretty much impossible to attack this kind of thing. But the years that you need to defend are long gone. So now it's just this amazing big building. This one isn't doing so well. That's why there's giant poles holding it up. It's gonna crumble one day. Those are full of cracks. No, you cannot go towards that building. Okay, let's go on the inside. Let's, let's go around though. Come on. So this village is not an abandoned village. It's really crowded, thousands and thousands of people. Maybe tens of thousands. But most people don't live in these old buildings anymore. Although, I think for obvious reasons. There's one of these buildings that we saw a minute ago that has electricity and internet. Okay, finally found the entrance. Let's go in. One of the things I like about exploring the world is I like to go to small places and find these, I don't know, ruins isn't the really right word. How about semi-abandoned, amazing, amazing architectural feats like this. This is so pretty. And it's just sitting here in the little village. This is part of Mars traveling, so whenever he comes to a new place, he'll let it touch the ground. He's exploring the Earth with himself, connecting to it. Now you can see he's kissing the Earth. The air is fresh. It's just amazing environment. Such a beautiful building. Sadly, it is falling apart. But at least it's preserved for now. So beautiful. Supposedly, this is Mao. I gotta say, it doesn't look like his other pictures, but fair enough. <laughs>